Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Please subscribe and keep watching for more details. 90 Day Fiancé, Happily Ever After Star Jasmine Panita hinted at a major update about her son's immigration to the U.S. after her split from Gino Palazzolo. Jasmine and Gino are seemingly together at the Happily Ever After Season 8, Tell All, but according to rumors, they split up in December 2023. Jasmine is rumored to have left Gino for a young aspiring actor named Matt Brennis. However, Jasmine hasn't given up on her dream of bringing her sons JC and Juance to America. She still holds Gino responsible for the immigration goof-up and seems to be correcting it herself. Jasmine was in for a shock when she saw that Gino had forgotten to mention her children's names on her visa application. Jasmine could have sought legal help from a professional to get her sons to the U.S. sooner, according to her Instagram story. Jasmine posted a selfie wearing a black hoodie with the text, Kelsey is my lawyer. Jasmine tagged at Kelsey Ksepkov in the Instagram story and wrote that she is her lawyer. Kelsey also reposted Jasmine's Instagram story to confirm that the 90 Day Fiancé star is her client. She added, thankful for you, my amazing client. When Jasmine had visited an attorney on 90 Day Fiancé, she found out that Gino's mistake led to her son's entry to the U.S. being delayed. It could have taken them as little as six months to relocate to America. However, because of Gino, it's now going to take them two years. Moreover, the process was costly, and Gino didn't seem interested in footing the lawyer's bills. Gino had an excuse of not having a job. He also had the excuse that he quit his job for Jasmine. Gino was already spending a lot on Jasmine's green card procedure. Gino might not have wanted to take up the responsibility of having Jasmine's kids in the U.S. Jasmine also wanted to get her sister Liz to live with them. It meant that Gino would have to take care of Watson J.C.'s schooling, as well as Liz's needs. Gino likely messed up Jasmine's kids' immigration process on purpose. He was not satisfied with Jasmine as his wife. Gino even refused to show intimacy towards her within months of their marriage. His grand plan could have been to send Jasmine back to Panama if things didn't work out. It appears Jasmine is now living with Matt. It's not known if Gino is still helping Jasmine with her change of status. Jasmine recently told a fan on Instagram that she didn't have access to her own money as she doesn't have a work permit yet. She can't withdraw the money she makes from an adult content platform until she has permanent residence in America. The 90 Day FNK Happily Ever After Star also claimed that she hasn't received child support in three years. Jasmine is hiding a lot of pain, although she wishes to share it with her fans.